Uh, Jean-Paul Amore and I'm the chair for the video game uh, design and development as well as video game design and animation programs. So the video game design and development program focuses on uh, programming and uh, design as the primary disciplines. Um, within the program students study um, anything related to programming for mobile, PC, web, as well as console development. Uh, throughout their studies, they also uh, learn topics in game design, so how to create games, the mechanics and gameplay of the games, as well as they study topics in audio. A student uh, in video game design and development is typically a student that uh, is passionate about games, definitely enjoys playing games, and has a knack for uh, technical uh, abilities. So uh, their interests are perhaps in math, physics, and definitely in programming. The program is very unique in the sense that uh, students interact with the, uh, students in the video game design and animation program to create games as a team um, that are relatively large in scale and uh, tentatively they try to commercialize their games. So the primary tools are uh, Visual Studio. Um, they use primarily C, C++, C Sharp as programming languages to develop their games. And in terms of engines, they use uh, Unity uh, as well as UDK. So upon graduation, uh, students in the video game design and development program typically um, become junior programmers for small, medium, large companies. Um, the focus is not entirely in uh, Ontario. There are also opportunities in other provinces in Canada as well as in the States. Um, from there, students could receive jobs as senior programmers uh, in as short as two years. Uh, in Toronto, there's uh, a big uh, uh, market for indie development, so smaller to medium-sized studios. But of course, we have larger studios like Ubisoft and Gameloft uh, that also employ our students.